guys welcome back to another video and if you're new welcome to my channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that little bell to get notified whenever I do upload new videos so today we're gonna be doing some poly gel nails and this poly gel set is super super easy so before I get into more of what we're gonna be doing in this nail video I do have several announcements first one is the giveaway announcement video so that video will be up on the 25th of me announcing who is the giveaway winner so if you have yet to enter that giveaway I will leave down below in the description box the link to that video all you have to do is follow all the rules and that's it second so I really don't know where to start with this one. So if you're an OG subby, I think you kind of figured out that I've been uploading twice a week, Tuesdays and Fridays, but I have never really officially announced it. And the reason why is because I wanted to see if I could keep up uploading twice a week without feeling any kind of strain or anything like that. And I have enjoyed uploading twice a week, but here's the thing with my kids starting school which is on Monday and unfortunately they're gonna be doing virtual learning so they're gonna be home and I'm not really gonna have a lot of time to do voiceovers for my videos but here's the thing every Tuesday that I upload videos I promise that I'm gonna be uploading videos every Tuesdays with a voiceover but with that being said for my Friday videos, I'm not sure whether if I'm going to continue doing a voiceover for those videos because whenever I do edit videos, that's the most consuming part for me is doing the actual voiceovers because I tend to blabber about random stuff and I get a subject regarding to the video. That's why it's a lot of work when it comes down to doing voiceovers for me. So it might be... You might not get a voiceover on that video, or you might, only on Friday's videos. But definitely for my Tuesday videos, you will be getting my voiceovers because I personally love interacting with you guys. So with that being said, so I think that's all the announcements I had to say. So in this video, I am using my poly gel from my cart because you guys already know I love this clear poly gel because it's the clearest one on the market and prior to that I did go in and added my base coat I know I don't really ever do that on video but I tend to do that because honestly it leaves that little sticky residue where it gives the adhesion for the poly gel to stick on right here I'm giving you two options of how to apply your poly gel the first finger was with a little silicone brush which I find it much easier to use opposed to a brush. I feel like I have more of a slick surface. I don't know. I just personally, my preference is to use the silicone brush. And in case you're going to ask me, yes, this is the hand that I got from AliExpress, I think. I would definitely leave that link down below for that video. If you guys haven't checked that out, make sure you do. You don't want to miss that video out. So right here, Whatever is left over towards the end, I just pop it back like around the cuticle area just to help me build my little apex. I try not to waste a lot of my poly gel. So instead of like wasting it, I just pop it back onto the actual nail. So dolls, I'm going to let you guys enjoy the rest of the video. I will be popping back in so you guys can see my struggle when I begin nail stamping. I'm not a professional. This is only my second time ever stamping a nail and honestly I feel like I fell. <laughs> I don't think they look so pretty so if you're a professional nail stamper give your girl some tips because honestly I need them. <laughs> so I'll be back in a little bit.
Okay, dolls, I'm back. And before you guys ask me, the nail plates are from Mundo de Uñas. I don't really remember exactly if that's the name, but I'm going to tell you guys. It took forever for this nail plates to get here. It took about four to three months to arrive where I live. And honestly, I was kind of disappointed. But I do appreciate that they did notify me that it was going to take a pretty long time for them to get here. So, with that being said, I think the plates are really good quality. And for the price, you can't beat it. That's why, I mean, I'm half disappointed and half not. So right here, you can see me do my little mistakes here and there. Let me know what I'm doing wrong. And if you could give me those tips, leave them down below in the comment section. Alright, my dolls, I'm going to let you guys enjoy the rest of this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Show me some love. Alright, see you guys until next time. Bye. Thank you.